Amanda Post, thanks for joining us today. We begin with the seismic move in local college athletics. Major announcement this morning about a move for a local college athletics department. Our Erie Sports Now team joins us live from Mercyhurst University with the new developments about a major jump for the Lakers program. Hi guys. Amanda, good morning. We're here inside the Mercyhurst Athletic Center as a big day. The Mercyhurst Lakers athletic program joining Division I Northeast Conference, making the move from Division II to Division I. And Isaac, this has been a move that's been about a decade in the making. Yeah, the official announcement coming today, they'll join the conference this upcoming fall for the 2024-2025 season. But like you said, when you want to make a move this big, you have to take years to be able to make it work. We sat down yesterday with Athletic Director Joe Spano, John, and he told you final touches were just a couple of weeks ago. But like you said, the process really began in the mid 2010s to get this rolling. And we were just hearing from many here at Mercyhurst, Amanda, as well as from the commissioner of the NEC saying this wasn't finalized until last Friday, so this is very new. Um, all the programs are going to remain. There are no cuts to any current programs. The Northeast Conference came through with their committee, said they love the facility, so no planned as of right now. Major upgrades, a couple of minor adjustments that will be made. Here's Joe Spano, though, uh, as we sat down with him yesterday about why this move was made now. You can see all the movement that's been happening at the, you know, the Power Five level and, you know, the conference changing and, you know, in a way that kind of trickles all the way down to, you know, some of the smaller conferences. Um, and this opportunity just kind of presented itself and it was just something that we felt as a university uh, it was the right move for us. Now, one of the things, John, that Joe told you yesterday that I found interesting is he said this is not a move that's for people who like being comfortable. They know that this is going to take some time to be able to get used to, whether that's getting athletes in, whether that's making new rivalries. But he felt like, as you heard, the time is now to do this move and one that's historic both for the university and for Erie as a whole. And a reminder for NCAA postseason eligibility, they won't be eligible for that for four years. Conference could be at least one, maybe two years. So postseason again it's going to be a process but a big day and certainly historic one here at Mercyhurst. For Isaac Petcash I'm John Lanik live at Mercyhurst University for Erie Sports.